This song is probably the most special to me because out of all the songs that came out of just alone time with the Lord, this one was actually a gift from the Lord um, in the moment. Um, it wasn't written before I recorded it. Um, I had just, I think at this point it was like two or two and a half years ago, um, I had just looked up Poin online um, and I masturbated and I felt so dirty and felt so distant from the Father and that was something that had been introduced to me in middle school and um, but in this moment it felt like I had torn my heart in two and it was so heavy and I was like pulling away in my shame um, and I heard the voice of the Father say, Son, come to the studio. I have a song for you. Um, so I went into my garage and flipped on a little light on my keyboard. And um, I knew that it was going to be in 3-4. Th and so I hit, I hit record in 3-4. Um, and then the song happened, and that's what you hear on Soul Hymns. For me, it's been such a special gift that the Lord would give me a song to sing in a moment of shame, to break the shame, and to encounter his presence um, minutes after my sin. Um, and that speaks a different image of who God the Father is than what I've been taught. Um, I really believe that God runs after us in those moments. Should we choose to recognize him? <sighs> He's closer than a brother. Um, when Jesus died, he tore the veil in two. And his presence flooded the earth at the Feast of Pentecost. So when we pray and when we worship, our prayers and our worship doesn't go past the ceiling. He's so here. And even when we sin, he doesn't, he doesn't just hear about it. He's there with us, offering us a better portion, his presence. And so in that moment, as I released my grip on everything that I was holding tightly to, everything that I had chosen, all the crap that I had chosen to look at, and all the ways I had chosen to <coughs> try to satisfy my own desires. He's the only thing that'll ever satisfy. Amen.
Father, that when we spit in your face, you wipe the spit away and you open your arms wide. And you look at us with a smile. 
you see us and you know us and you still chose us. When we were dead in our sins, you chose us. Jesus, you came to give new life to a bride. We want to be swept away in your romance, Jesus, and your burning eyes of love. We want to be captivated by your heart. And so right now, all we want to say is yes. Say yes to you, Jesus. Amen. Thank you.